Hi everybody, <laughs> it's your girl Nayanda. Today I decided I wanted to answer some of your questions that you guys sent to me on the Twitter and Facebook. So I'm really trying to go through them, but I have to be honest, I'm kicking the ones that I just find are a little bit different questions that I have not been asked that frequently. So, the first one, I, I like this question, it's from Adam Marley and he asks, are you a fan of old school reggae? I was actually just asked to do a countdown of my favorite reggae dance hall songs of all time and I have to say a lot of them were old school records like Coca-Cola Bucket Shade, like Donna, like you know singing sweet, I love Pinchers, I love, you know what I mean, um, Murder She Wrote. So a lot of the, the, the dance hall records that I actually love, my favorites are old school, so yes I do love old school records. The next question is from Bass Viver Buviri. And he said, who is now in our free time? Um, I'm a sister, I'm a mom, I am a friend, daughter, lover. <laughs> so I'm all things. Maybe you could say I'm a bit of a schizo. So but I'm all things. I'm still trying to learn about myself. And actually on this album, with this music that I'm making now, I, I like surprising myself and doing different music that I would normally do, but I, I'm trying to explore different sides of myself creatively also in the in the studio. But music is a part of who I am, so to ask me who I who I am I am music. So anyway, next question. <laughs> so I I'm gonna big up this fan because I know Kyle Ethel Morrill. <laughs> Kyle is one of Brick and Lace slash Nyanda slash Nyla, one of our biggest fans. And Kyle, big up to you. And I have to say, you know, I, I appreciate the support and I appreciate that you're always there rallying us on and, and encouraging us and everything. So you asked, when will, we, when will we be seeing a music video to any one of your songs? I've just been, and this is actually going to answer the question, are you working on a solo album? Because I've just been releasing singles, because right now I'm establishing myself as a solo artist, so I want to get as much feedback as possible from the fans. I know what the Brick and Lace fans like, but now launching as Nyanda, as a solo artist, I'm not so sure, so we're vibing it out. But definitely we're going to be shooting videos for Slippery When Wet. I'm just gonna put it out there because sometimes I'm putting things out there into the universe. <laughs> I'm gonna put it out for slippery when wet, wine like a pro. Trouble? Fans, let me know. <laughs> what should you want for trouble? So I'm on to Bernard James. Bernard, thank you for your comments and thank you for your question. And he's asking, just wondering about your background. Which parish do you call home? Do you prefer rum punch or red stripe? Do you prefer Bami or breadfruit? That's an interesting question. I'm from Kingston and I went to Campion College, the best high school in the I prefer red stripe, a cold red stripe. That's where it's at. I love fried Bami when my grandma makes it, but I would say I definitely prefer fried breadfruit when my mom makes it. Um, this is a cute one. Well, it's not cute, but it's from Tabisa TZ Molly Bell. The question is, was it scary to release a solo single? It's not scary, but it's new. And um, sometimes when you do something new, it's scary. And it's different. It's challenging, you feel like. Out of your comfort zone, I guess. And I have felt a bit out of my comfort zone. So I want <laughs> but I think that's how you grow. You know, I think you have to face fear and then you just have to, you know, go on the ride. You know, <laughs> it's like, you know, when I'm in the line. You know, on to, to go on the roller coaster, the scariest roller coaster. I'm scared as hell when I'm in that line. And there's a lot of times when I'm thinking, I'm gonna come out of this line. <laughs> you know, like, I'm thinking, what the hell am I doing here? And I just feel like, at the end of it all, you, you stay there and go to the line and reach the front. And it's, it is scary, but. <sighs> 
then I never regret it because I'm always like, that was awesome. And I always end up going again. And then you end up going in the line again and going, what the hell am I doing in this line again? But it ends up, it ends up being something great. So, so thank you so much guys for sending me your questions um, on Twitter and Facebook. If I did not get to respond to you on this vlog, I will be shooting again next week and answering some more of your questions. So you can also send more questions and um, I will try to respond to it very privately as I can if I'm not going to do it on a video vlog. But thank you again for your feedback also on the music. I really appreciate it. You know, let me know what songs you're liking and everything. And so, um, God bless you and peace out.